Alright, it's time for King of Quiz, and we've got the very popular Eli in the studio. Hi, Eli. Hi, Nuna. What's up? Oh, 방송인 다 되셨네요. Because <laughs> uh, he comes to this studio, he's just like, Nuna, I'm so tired. <laughs> and then as soon as the mic comes out, he's like, hi, Nuna. Okay, yes. so you guys are pro. <laughs> pro, pro, pro. It looks like you guys have been busy, though. Mm-hmm. Very, very busy. Uh, with, uh, uh, you guys have been shooting a non-smoking campaign mm -hmm. and uh, all this other stuff. But yes. at least you guys have chance to uh, go to church on Sundays and uh, it looks yes, like... Yes, yes, yes. Okay. I wanted to go to church this week, but I went to sleep. Well, yes. sometimes uh, I slept in. it's good to meditate and pray <laughs> on your own. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, I've been getting a chance to uh, see some good updates from uh, the other members. Mm -hmm. uh, Alexander and uh, Kevin seem to have changed their phones, and so they've been using yes, finally. Twitter a lot. <laughs> Are you still using your other phone, or did you get a new phone too? I have two phones. <laughs> yes, two phones. Okay. You have a Korean one, which you... Got as a gift, and you have your other one, which is the same one as mine, yes. right? Yes. Okay. Anywho, well, we're going to be getting into our King of Quiz today, mm -hmm. so could you give us the rules? Yep. Everyone, there's five questions overall. Please listen to all five questions and send in your answers at the end of the quiz. Okay. 총 다섯 문제가 나가고요. 다섯 문제를 다 들으신 후에 정답을 보내주시길 바랍니다. All right. You know what? Uh, I was uh, talking with my friend yesterday, and I was talking mm -hmm. with her, and she just kept fighting and fighting and fighting and fighting with her boyfriend. And actually, this is, I think, going to help us with our first question. Yes. 그 물과 기름과 같은 사이군 궁합이 안 맞는 거야. Yo! Compatibility. Wow, Eli, your Korean's getting better. Yeah. All right, but yes, kung up pretty much means uh, not just marital compatibility, it's just compatibility with whichever. Uh, if you are compatible with somebody, mm -hmm. uh, you end up, you know, having a good relationship with them, and then you find that you have a long relationship with them. But uh, yes, you are right. Uh, my friend and her boyfriend are just like water and oil. They do not mix. <laughs> and so they don't really have this perfect compatibility. 네, 맞아요. 음식도 서로 궁합이 안 맞는 음식도 있어요. Yep. 그럼 오늘 OX 퀴즈. 우유와 설탕은 서로 궁합이 안 맞는 음식 중에 한... 음식 중에 하나다. Okay. 마지막 틀리면 X. So, if you uh, were talking about food that just don't really go together. Now, today we're going to be looking at milk and sugar. And is milk and sugar a good match? Not for specific type of, uh, you know, taste. I'm not talking about some odd, you know, ways of eating food. I'm mm -hmm. talking about just normally. Is milk and sugar compatible? Yes or no. Hmm. hmm. Yes or no. All right. Well, we are going to uh, be moving on. I, I want to try and give you guys some more hints, but I don't know if we can. Hmm. <laughs> okay. If we do, I think we're going to give away the answer, so yes. I think we're just going to have to pass that one up. All right. Number two. We're going to be uh, getting into this. Now, listen to the way we're talking about and uh, try and figure out what it is. 네. Eli, 네? what is around us? Uh, 음, 주먹을 쥐고 있는데 어떻게 알아요? 뭔데 이거 이게? <laughs> See? Okay. Think about it. Think about it. Uh, even though I have my fists clenched together, it's something that is in here. It's also around it as well. All right. Now it is invisible. 음, 숨을 쉴수 없다면. 생물은 다살 수가 없겠네요. Yep, if you uh if we can't breathe this, then we're not going to be able to live. And uh if we don't have this, then uh, we don't get a chance to have sound either because sound waves travel through this. Also, we can't breathe with this either and it's pretty similar to uh Chinese song. 
Oh, oh. <laughs> it's kind of it's kind of uh, similar to that, but uh, that one's talking about a certain type of stuff that's around us. But uh, mm -hmm. it is something like that. And I'm currently on air right now with Eli. Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so, what could this be? What is this? Uh. Jordan Sparks and Chris Brown sing a song of this title. Mm -hmm. It is No Blank. And uh, let's see here. Hmm. Uh, if you think of those big balloons that uh, fly in the air with people in them, they are hot blank balloons. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see here. What else? There's a shoe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> those are those shoes that you used to pump. Do, these, yeah. do you still pump them? Yeah. Do you still pump them? Yeah. Okay, see, I, I'm not into sneakers like that. But <laughs> I remember when they first came out in junior high, it was uh, Michael Jordan, I think, that was uh, mm. the whole big model behind it. And if you, yeah. you pump them, you pump them to get them up. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And if you pump them too much, they pop. Remember that? Yeah, 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 yeah. The little, like, powder or whatever pops out yeah. of it. <laughs> <laughs> powder. Okay. okay. <laughs> Anyways, what is this? What is this? Hmm. Yeah, what is this? Okay. What is this? Also, if you just look at it, the Korean name, it also is the same name of a game. Hmm. It's the same name as a Korean game in Korean. 한글로 따지면요, 아 이것도 되고요. 어렸을 때 가지고 놀았던 그 놀이랑도 비슷해요 이름이. It has five little pebbles, and you have 일 년, 이 년, 삼 년, 사 년, 오 년. Ah. Flip it over. And then you catch it with yeah, your catch hand. your hands. <laughs> yes. See, okay, we gave you guys a <laughs> lot of hints with that one. All right, now number three, she is Asia's star, and she has debuted ten years ago. She's very, very young indeed, but she is huge. Yes, this person debuted with ID PSB when she was fifteen. Yep. 요즘 어린 나이에 데뷔하시는 분들이 많은데 이분이 원조라고 하는 거. Yep. All right. Now the song that we're listening to right now is 나내 세상이죠. All right. I D P S B. Then she went on to uh, get into more popularity with number one, My Name, and Girls on Top. 네, 최근 5년 동안 해외에서 열심히 활동하는 이 가수. Mm -hmm. 일본에선 발매한 앨범마다 오리콘 차트 10위 안에 드는 탑. 이거 미국에서 Eat You Up으로 빌보드 차트 15위에 랭크도 했죠. All right, so yeah, she's been uh, busy overseas for the past five years. She's uh, always gotten in at least to the top 10 for the Oricon charts. And with Eat You Up, she also made it on to number 15 on the Billboard charts. Now, she is coming back to Korea, and it looks like she is going to be making an amazing comeback. She has the name of a snake as well, but yes. uh, this is her original name. Who is this? Kayani said, I'm a nugar kayo. All right. Well, if you guys think you know who it is, don't send it in quite yet. Wait until we send all five uh, questions out so you can send in all five answers. Right now, we got Mary J. Blige and Drake singing the one.